Hello, my name is Janet Masifich and my gene number is 1630. The name of my um, protein is MIC type basic helix loop helix BHLH domain containing protein. And the percentage of clones similar to my clone is 0%. So I got a new gene again. <laughs> okay, um, the biological process is transcription. The molecular function is transcription um, factor activity. And the most likely tissue location is unknown since we don't really know where these are, uh, where these proteins are in plants. The most likely cellular, cellular, cellular location is the nucleus. So the physiological role. So transcription in general is DNA being transcribed into mRNA. As you can see in this picture, um, you need transcription factors for this process to occur. Okay. And so, my protein contains BHLH, which stands for basic helix loop helix. And so the structure of that in general, you can see um, that um, it contains two helices, alpha helices with um, joined together by a loop. So that's the structure. So BHLH proteins are associated with transcription factors in eukaryotes. So they are necessary for DNA binding because if the BHLH protein lacks a basic domain, then you it can act as a negative regulator, so the transcription factor can't bind to DNA, so you won't be able to transcribe DNA into mRNA. So MYC, the, part, the MYC type that's in the first part of my protein name, is one family of BHLH proteins, and specifically its role is in cell proliferation and differentiation. And it's also oncogenic, which means like it can cause development of tumors. And one interesting fact is um, one of the most frequently affected genes are MYC genes in human tumors. So in plants, not much is known about my protein in general. So, and there are no, there's no evidence that this protein causes allergies. Thank you for watching. <laughs> In plants, not much is known about these genes, and there is no evidence that this protein causes Okay, make time. Have a great Thanksgiving.